this is Swamp Yankee Dippin' here. Swamp Yankee Dippin' back here for yet another dip review. It's been way what, too freaking months. long. Months. It's what? been a long time. Way was, too damn long for me. I was working me. a lot. He was working a lot. And I still am working and, a lot. Yeah. And then holidays came and... Ah, it sucks when you work for a living, right? Yeah. Yeah, it does. It's, especially when you don't have time. And especially and this time of year, it's December 30th. Fucking holidays. So Christmas was literally like five days ago. Yeah, and then tomorrow's New Year's New Year. Year's is tomorrow and the next day. So everyone's getting fucked up. Yeah, except for Pretty us. much... We're I'll just leave this week. lonely people. Don't worry. You don't have to read the text. Just leave. The, don't fucking read the text. No. Read it later. Don't. Don't. You're gonna knock it over. Oh, shit. <laughs> now you zoomed. It, you zoomed it in somehow. I, I am getting. Uh, we are not tech savvy, by the way. Yeah. No. no. We we are getting. Um, I got a new phone though. I got a new phone. I got a new phone too, but it's he the same. Destroyed his. But it's the same phone. Um, I I I demolished the cam or the the screen. Basically, what happened was um. Oh, my girlfriend. Ah, so anyways, guys, we're here to review Skull Spearmint. You know, I don't know about where other places in the country, but around here, this one's actually kind of hard to find. No, it is. It There's only two stores I know of in the area that sell it, and that is, well, one of them is not too far. It's in Thompson. The, the other, other one's in Brooklyn. Other than fucking Brooklyn. Half hour right away at a Extra Mart or something. Extra. No. Yeah, Extra Mart. The other one is uh, Valero's in Thompson. Only two places I know that sell this shit. Only two fucking places. I actually like this stuff. It, it's pretty good. Actually, the Valeros. I've, I've only had two tins before this one. The Valeros and in New Hampshire doesn't even sell it. It's uncracked, by the way. Brand uncracked. new tin. Actually, it's not a brand new tin. I've had it for like two weeks. But. Yeah, because we were supposed to do a review on it two weeks ago. <sighs> Sorry, it was just so fucking busy. Last week and Fuck. three days ago and a few days ago, a few hours ago. We, we just kept putting it off, and it's partly my fault. Yeah, seriously, it actually is. But anyways, guys, but, so for a date on here, we got February 28th. That's actually a pretty damn good date. Especially my, for it already being two weeks old yeah. for Skull around here. And I got here. a can of Copenhagen over there, ap April 16th or something. That's a fucking really That's good date. That's almost unheard of for yeah, around here. Unless you, buy, kidding. unless you buy Stoker's by the tin, because Stoker's by the tin. Well, I, that, that was because they just got in stock. It was all brand new shit. Duh. Well, but no, anyways, guys, Stoker's keeps anyway. So let's go straight into this because we're already two and a half minutes in. You don't want to wait fucking ten minutes but fucking put a lip in. I know, it's fucking annoying. I watch reviews too. It's fucking annoying to take forever to put a lip in. So guys, for presentation, I actually really like this tin. That, that, I don't know why. That fucking light blue. I like blue, the color. The, the color. The light blue, blue. The metallic light blue, the way it shines. It's a damn good looking tin. Well, I don't think it's metallic, but, <laughs> well, you know. Well, it's made he, out of metal. He's not a painter. I don't know. It's a good looking tin, all right? And they had this like checkerboard, not checkerboard, like dots honeycomb. on the side. Honeycomb. That's the word I was looking for. It's a honeycomb on the sides thing. Here. I've heard a lot of negative things about it, but I think it's cool. I think out of all the, I like out it. of all the skull tins that basically all look like this, I think this one actually looks good. Except for uh, skull original. Well, cut, the, the style of this shit. But I think this mm -hmm. one actually looks good. I think the coloration they use is excellent. So overall, very good looking can. So let's go ahead and crack this. Mine. Cracker open, throw in a lip. Well, we gotta smell it first. Well, yeah. So. Spearmint. Imagine how that, it's it's not like an extra Ooh, mint, it's a boy. spearmint. Smells like toothpaste, but the good Oh, candy. it smells just like toothpaste. But this is not a bad smell, like the other toothpaste ones we had, those were bad. This one, mm -hmm. this one's what you expect to smell, Actually, it's that's pretty the flavor good. it's supposed to be. It, it, it smells like a extra gum, Dude, like a that, spearmint gum. That's fucking full, too. That is full to the brim. Let's see if it goes out of a packet. Dude, that's fucking full. Dude, that, 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 that's fucking full. It's pretty much full to the brim. Now, for darkness, it's a little bit on the on the light side. Kind yeah, of, it it's a darker. little light brown. It looks darker on camera. But it's actually kind of a lighter. It's still a dark color, oh, but it's not black. So that's kind of concerning me. It kind of seems like it's going to be dry. Well, But I'm, I've had this dip before, so I'm not going to uh, spoil it. I'm just saying what it looks yeah. like. It looks to be dry. All right, guys. So, smells to be dry. <coughs> Just kidding. You oh, can't by the tell way, by sorry. Smell. I've been coughing since Christmas. I don't know. I think I got something. But guys, pack a lip with us. Hope you're packing something good. Hopefully, it's not fucking Klondike. If it's Klondike, who well, actually has a full line, I can't believe that. Yeah, I, I was on Northern. Klondike sucks. They have everything. Penis. Sucks dick. I hate Klondike so fucking much. <laughs> oh, I hate much. Klondike. So pinchability. Not bad. It's a little on the dry side, so it's really not sticking together. But 
spearmint is the, the school of spearmint is kind of a dry dip. Um, the last thing I had was actually pretty moist. I was actually surprised. Yeah, I've heard a lot about it being dry. Uh, the last lip I had of it was dry as fuck. Yeah, it's dry. It just freaking fell apart. But um, I expect that to happen. Because I like every review you say, you'll see. Is that it is. February? 28th or 2016 or 2015 <laughs> if it's that dry but once it uh, juices up it actually is pretty good I, I do warn you it is I've only had one tin that was moist mm. and it really wasn't all that moist okay pinchability not bad packability different story um I'm not going to tell you it's terrible but I will tell you that um it will fall apart when you put it in your mouth. Just a little bit. I, I didn't have a problem. I did. I just uh, did. Well, it's because you're warm. Well, I come, I, I'm come. i coming down to skull from dipping stokers. Yeah, dude. So, Ever since I started selling stokers by the tin, I, I said, fuck, there's green. I went straight to fucking stokers. That shit is good. You got me, he got me a tub of stokers for Christmas. I did. Merry Christmas to John. He got um, a tub of stokers wintergreen. <laughs> Merry Christmas to me. I got him a fatty patty blub blub blub. Yes, <laughs> he did, and I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I, I, I he got me a sex blow up doll. Fatty Patty. Fatty he Patty. Three hundred pounds. Yeah, probably. Right. So um, now that it started to juice up and it actually isn't dry, um, I had to wait for it to juice up. Um, tastes just like you would expect it. Definite spearmint taste. It's it's actually a really pleasant taste. You just have to let it dry up first. It, it, dry up? You gotta let it dry out so you can taste did it. I said dry? <laughs> you, you did. You gotta let it dry up a little bit before you can taste it. Whoops. Sorry, guys. You know what I meant, right? Yeah. So when it's dry, you can taste it. Did, did I mention if it's dry, you can taste yeah. it? So, guys, when it once it juices up, um, you have to wait. Uh, what's that, like a minute or so? Once it yeah. does, it flavors actually really good. Last ability... It's really not. It la you'd be lucky if you get 25 minutes out of it. It doesn't last that long. Um, it's not like Stoker's. <laughs> yeah, I'd say for for this dip, 20 minutes, 20, maybe a half hour, depending on what size of lips you throw in. Yeah. 20 minutes, pretty much tops. Um, it's really not gonna. It, it the last ability sucks. Um, it's dry anyway. Honestly, unless you get a really good tin, like freshly made, as in packed yesterday. Um, it's going to be dry. It's probably going to be dry, but flavor is good. Uh, packability is not terrible. There's not that many floaters going around up in there. Nope. Actually, packability, I think, is better than most skull. This is the best skull that I've had for packability. Um, I think I'm going to agree with you on that one. Yeah. Actually, personally. I think I'll agree with him on that one. It does have pretty good packability compared to other skull we've had, especially that fucking fine cut. Ugh. But, guys, it's actually pretty good. I mean, I have had it before. Uh, I like it. I don't know how he, do you like it? I do. Um, I like spearmint, like in general. Um, so the fact that Skull makes a spearmint, I think is pretty fucking awesome. And they're the only. Oh, it's not true. They are not the only one that makes a spearmint. No. Found out the other day. Klondike. Don't say. Oh. Klondike makes. Ow. Uh, Klondike makes wintergreen, mint, straight, natural spearmint, and peppermint. And cherry. And. Oh, and. and, and and, cherry and fruits, cherry and I think grape or something. Why? But, uh, Wait, why does Klondike also, exist? They also sell it in tubs. Why? That means someone somewhere out there in this world dips Klondike. Can I meet you? Someone? I want to meet you oh so I can God. buy you a good tin of dip, whether it's Skull. No, fuck. I'll buy you Stokers. You'll never go back to fucking Klondike, and it's not even that much more expensive. No, actually, Stokers only three sixty-eight ten. Right now, three yeah. sixty eight ten. It's, it's, it's pretty 20, good. Twenty twenty one something for a tub. It, it's cheap. But uh, no skull skull spearmint here. Excellent looking tin. Excellent flavor. Last of the ability is really not there. It is dry. It is hard to find out around here. Not not very popular around here. I don't know about the rest of the country. Yeah, I know around here it's hard to find. It, it was in it was it was everywhere at one point, but they're starting to recall it. Probably because if it's dry, a lot of people don't want it if it's dry. Well, so. The guy I got it from in Thompson, he actually special orders it, keeps it in stock for one customer. So at least one person really likes it. I like it too. So, 
I, I like it, but I will not dip it every day. I like spearmint, but I don't. Well, see, I, I would get sick of spearmint. It's like a quick. 15 minute ride for me to Valeros and Thompson's. Uh, it's now, like 20, now that 20. I know it's there, um, I'll probably be going there every, now, every couple of weeks to get a tin or two. Because I do like to have a tin every now and then. Uh, I'll mix a tin of this, uh, have a lift or two a week. A tin will last me a week or two. Uh, but this stuff is good. I like to have it right now and then. The flavor is good. Uh, the dryness will kind of set you off first, but once once it gets going, it's actually a pretty good dip. Yes, it is a very good dip. Um, nicotine, I'm not feeling it. No, there, no, there is no nicotine there, in this. There, there is nicotine, <sighs> but very little. Not enough to do anything. Um, spit. Mm. Moderate tea, moderate tea, uh, I can't even talk right now. It's pretty light. Yeah. It's a little on the light side. Moderate. I don't even know how to pronounce that word right now. Yeah, it's not really. I mean, <laughs> you're an idiot. I mean, moderate. It's not all that juicy. Um, moderate. Does, moderately. Once you guys will know. Moderately light. Would you shut up? I got it. <laughs> I got the word. It, Fuck it, you. It does have. Once you get going, it does have pretty good juice going. It has good flavor. The flavor lasts for probably 20, 25 minutes. And then once you take it out, then you take it out. It starts to because it, it just gets dry and that awkward feeling in there. But uh, aftertaste tastes like spearmint. Tastes yeah. like spearmint. You know that taste after you brush your teeth with that really nice spearmint fucking toothpaste? Tastes just like that. Or after spearmint gum? That's what it tastes like. Yep. It is not a bad aftertaste at all. It actually tastes really good. Yes. So very you very. You will not be disappointed to take out your lip. No. Um, if you like spearmint, if you like mints, I think you'd like it. I like Definitely it. Definitely go out and try this dip. It's an excellent dip. If you don't really like it, it's only a tin. It's not going to last you that fucking long. No. So, I mean, definitely go out and try this dip. Excellent dip. Uh, I don't think I really recommend dipping it every day because it is kind of dry, at least when you start out. But uh, overall rating? Uh, six. I, oh, I would say a six or a seven. A uh, seven's kind of stretching it. But I'd say a six because it's dry. Uh, dry I don't, and I don't really like last. Dry and, dry and last ability last, lacking. So, so I'll, I'll give it them on a 6 out of 10. Well, mm -hmm. it's not bad. Definitely go out and try. Buy a tin. It's not expensive. Well, shouldn't say that. Massachusetts tax the shit out of you. Tax the Chusets. Uh, <laughs> yeah. No kidding. Definitely not a bad dip. So go if you're from try. Mass, I'm sorry. Yeah, 7 bucks a fucking tin. But we're from shit. Connecticut. Our laws suck. So... Oh well. And you gotta get what you gotta get, but uh, no, spirit, close school spirit, good dip, definitely go out and try it. Thumbs up. Not two, up. but one. Yeah. Stokers gets two. I, gets I two. actually really wish that other companies make a spearmint dip, because I do like the flavor, but Skull just really didn't nail it on this one. And it's not bad, but I, I think they could do a lot better. Uh, it doesn't have to be dry, they could do something to it, I don't know. Okay. I, I ain't no expert on fucking tobacco what we're gonna do we're gonna so. try this and we'll probably put it on video we're gonna add water to it and see what happens well okay why not like it not why the not? next review next review is coming up soon promise soon. promise not tonight so we don't have another thing in depth to review no we do not guys. because we've already reviewed everything so that's uh swamp yankee dipping swamp for you. yankee dipping for you back here for another and we will be back for yet another one after this and it's not going to take a month this time hopefully not sorry so guys. swamp yankee dip please forgive us swamp yankee dipping. swamp yankee dipping